I'm so excited. It's official. We are an adult because I'm finally, <laughs> my baby, I'm finally creating my command center. Y'all are so crazy. Okay. 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 Let me talk. Let me talk. Okay. Everybody be quiet. Quiet on the set. Quiet on the set. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I am so excited to finally create my command center. I feel like such a big girl now because listen, I grew up with a command center. Like I didn't realize that this was such an important thing for my life as a mom until I was talking to my own mom. And she was just telling me about like how she had a calendar on the wall. And like, so it was just so important for my mom to have like a central location where all of our things were, like she could keep up with, you know, what our chores were, what we were gonna eat, like all the different things. And I was just like, man, why haven't I created one of those yet? So that is what I'm gonna spend today doing. And I'm just gonna kind of talk about real quick why or what the function of my, my command center is. Because I feel like it's so important that we go into creating these with a like actual reason because I was looking on Pinterest of course and on Pinterest there's just so many options for how you can like create your command center and what you should have in your command center and I was just like you know what I need to make sure that I'm prioritizing function over everything else like even though I want the aesthetic to be there I want it to look nice I have to prioritize the function of it so I chose I, it was two spots I was going to put it either near our like in our living room or on a empty wall inside the kitchen because both of those are like central locations for the family but i decided on i'm going to use this area that's in the living room because we spend the most time here in the living room like between the living room and the playroom which i didn't want in the playroom because it would be kind of out of sight out of mind but right here in the living room is a perfect spot so we're gonna do we're gonna set it up in the living room and for me the biggest things that i wanted it to have i wanted to have a section or an area where we had like our main calendar and even though tay and i sync our calendars digitally i just know that like for me sometimes i need a break from my phone like i need a break from having to look on a screen for something and so having it on this wall is going to be a godsend for that so that was thing number one thing number two is i needed a clock <laughs> i needed somewhere to tell time i know i could ask alexa to tell me what time it is which she's about to say something now we also needed somewhere to put our keys when we come in the house so we're gonna have somewhere for our keys to go i would really love to buy like a little some kind of like table or something so that we can like dump the diaper bag or dump like different things on it i'm not too keen right now on hanging it although maybe depending on how everything looks I might hang it on the wall but maybe if I found like a cute hook or something that would work I could hang the diaper bag on the wall I also wanted somewhere for us to have our meal calendar like what we're gonna eat every day I have it in my in my phone I want to put it up on the wall that way um, if I am working or something like that he can see it and he can know like okay this is what we're having for dinner and he can go ahead and start cooking so I wanted to have um, the meals just up on the wall that way anybody can just pitch in and cook even when Tay's parents come over y'all see what's on the wall go on a fridge and cook it um <laughs> so that is the idea behind having that section so clock calendar the meal plan and then also we needed somewhere to put our keys i said that and then and lastly the other thing is that i really wanted somewhere to leave notes for tay because tay wakes up a lot earlier than us and he leaves the house and so i really wanted to have somewhere that i could like leave him notes whether it's a note of like endearment or if it was just hey don't forget to pick up x y and z right because it'll be next to the keys he will be able to see it and keep it going and then i also want and i'm not sure how i'm gonna do this yet but i also want to have somewhere for like chores but not chores in a sense of like oh these are the kids chores because i haven't really started them on chores yet they really do chores with me but just for myself so i know like okay on Monday, this is where I'm focusing on Tuesday, this is where I'm focusing because I do a daily 15 minute clean, but I would love to just have like a known routine for how I am going to be cleaning. So the purpose of this command center really is so that I can like, when I'm sitting here, cause I, I'm usually sitting in this spot actually in the living room at all times. Anytime I need to, I can just look over and see what needs to be done or where I'm gonna be focusing. Yes, baby. Yeah, I'm huh? Uh, uh, you be here, so in this room. Are you in here? Okay, I'm in here. You're in the playroom. I'm recording. And you are. What are you doing? Uh, turn on the tablet. Okay. okay, turn the tablet up just a little bit. Okay. Not too loud. Cool? Uh, Alright. Break. Yeah. Team. Alright, go ahead. So, yes, 
I'm excited about this command center because like I said, I'm sitting here a lot of the time during the day, like whenever we're just like kind of hanging out once I have things finished. So I really want a command center that allows me to just be able to keep up with the day to day things, but not have it in my brain. I also think I need to add somewhere for like a grocery list to go. Like when we're running out of groceries, just somewhere to jot it down until I put it on my clipboard. Um, maybe I could put a clipboard on the wall. Well, I don't know because I would want it to be something that's removable. So I'm, I'm still thinking that through. I might end up putting like just a little sticky note or something on the fridge for the grocery list and then you know whenever I decide to do groceries for the week I can do that so I know this command center is gonna be a game changer just because like I said a lot of things live in my head all the time or I'll just like forget appointments I'll forget different things so my hope is that this command center really just helps me get a better grip on what we're doing day to day Try to decide between two different key things. So this is one. It's gonna have like a shelf like this. This is one option. And then there's this. I'm feeling this one a little bit more just because it has like a bar and it's like, I can put mail in this, but you can put mail on this shelf as well. Only thing about this is I don't know how to hang it. Oh, okay, I see. So it has hardware right here that I can mail, mail into the wall. So, okay, we're gonna do this one. Uh, I do something. I can take do this. Is that my no. Different, different. My daughter is boo. Ew, it's a thing. It's a, a garbage. What? Huh? What are you talking about? It's a, it's about you at my house. Obviously this isn't like straight, but I just wanted to see how I wanted to put it up on the wall. So I think I'm going to do this. this. Now let's get it up on the wall. Uh, it's still crooked. No, that side is the wrong. Don't take it up. Take it. <laughs> Back at Target because we didn't buy. Well, I didn't buy. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't buy enough command strips. Okay. Suzanne, how did this look? See, this is too tall though because. Yeah, you can't see, so. I can't see myself. So, it has to be like here. Right. Hello, 